Hello, I'm Father Jim Gardner, and I'm talking to you from the Franciscan Monastery of the Holy Land here in Washington, D.C. Pope Francis last year said that he wanted the year 2015 celebrated as a year of consecrated life so, and to give thanks for the recent past of all the religious orders and to claim the future with, uh, with hope. And there were a number of events that are being scheduled throughout the world, throughout the country, uh, even in the in metropolitan area like Washington, D.C., a number of events. And here at the monastery, we're adding our own particular spin to this a year of consecrated life by having a monthly gathering of women and men religious of all ages, all shapes, all sizes, all different perspectives. We're inviting them to come together with the help of a, a, a facilitator, for the want of a better word, a resource person, and, and we're calling the series of conversations Claiming Our Future. What does the future hold for religious orders? What, do the, what are the hopes, what are the dreams, what are the fears of individual religious? We're going to meet on the second Tuesday of every month right here in, the, in this conference room. And even if you're not in Washington, D.C., and you want to take part in the conversation, you'll be able to see it at least and hear it at least uh, by uh, logging on to our, uh, our website, www.myfranciscan.org. If you go to the website, you can see and hear the conversation that's taking place. You can also do something else during this year of consecrated life. You can pray. Pray for those who are members of religious orders right now. You pray for those who are considering a vocation, listening for that call of the Lord. You can pray to the Lord, beseech the Lord to, as Francis said, send many brothers and sisters uh, to uh, consecrated life. So please join us uh, uh, this coming year, 2015, Year of Consecrated Life. I'm Father Jim Gardner, Franciscan Monastery of the Holy Land, Washington, D.C. Thank you for your attention.